Uh, hello YouTube and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to make this display case type object. I'll just play this quickly. As you can see it's pretty basic. Ju you can use it just for showing off a single thing or I don't know. It might come in handy one day. So go on a blender with the default cube selected. This is just going file new. Just size it up on the z-axis, 2, shift A to add a new cube, grab z-axis, get just so it's above it, that's ok I guess. View front, go into wireframe mode, tab into edit mode, Select the bottom face, delete it. Tab out of edit mode, tab go into the bottom box, tab and edit mode with that. Vertices select mode. Select these top vertices. Extrude them, then just left click. Then size that down, let's say 0 0.9. Then extrude that 0 0.02. Nope. Um, still too big. Okay, uh, zero point one seems gives you that right there, which is not that bad. It's quite good actually. It's better than what I had before anyway. Okay, go into the. Uh, top box, view top, size it in, S, shift Z, this is just so it doesn't make the box any bigger, it only makes it smaller on the sides. Go into modifiers, add modifier, solidify, let's ramp this up to 0 0.12. Size it out again, shift Z. Yeah, whatever, that's all right. And that that bit there is just a lip that goes up inside because that's what the ones in real life actually have. It's not perfectly flat across the top, it's got a little bit of a lip so the glass has something to slide down into. Okay, let's start on what the glass looks like. New material, go down into transparency, set the alpha to 0 0.5. 0 0.05 I meant. Or maybe amp that up a little bit. You want it so you can see through it, but you can still see it. Um, uh, let's add a texture to this bottom bit quickly. Wood. Change this to, let's go green. Go back to the materials tab. Let's make this red. So now I'm going to have a green and red strapped box. Let's put something inside of it. Let's chuck a monkey in. Mesh monkey. Size it down considerably. S minus two. Nope, that's, that just looked messed up. Okay, just size it down manually. Grab it Z -ax the, on the z-axis. Rotate x-axis 90 degrees go on a camera mode by pressing 0 just adjust this camera press G to move it then middle uh, G middle mouse click to why isn't it not moving okay G middle mouse click and just move your mouse up and down to go in more grab it again 
just get the box nice and centered. Rotate the monkey on the Z axis 45 so it's looking directly at you. View top. So get out of perspective. Going all. Okay, that's like dead center right there. Shift A, add a lamp, a sun lamp will do. Grab it on the Z axis, move it up so it's inside the box, but. Eh, yeah, that might work. Smooth the monkey by clicking, clicking shade smooth. Go on to camera mode, move this light over there. Now let's render this out, render image. And as you see, the monkey's jaw is getting cut off, but that was because I didn't take much care with positioning him. But you can see how it's got like a thick layer around the outside that gives it that glassy look. You can always color the glass. Glass has usually got like a blue tinge to it, so yeah. And that bottom is just looks crazy. But yeah, that's how I do my um, display case. That's just a quick one. I mean, if, if I took more care with that, I could probably make one that looks better, a lot better. But yeah. Well, thanks for watching. If you have any comments on what you think I'm doing wrong or could do better, just post them below in the comment section. And uh, thanks. Also, before I stop this, if there's any tutorials that you want on how to make something, I'll show you what I've made so far in Blender. I've made um, display case, obviously, um, a, s a few swords. Yeah, like three or four swords, a table, a very, very weird looking man, wherever that is. Yeah, my man too, yeah. Um, a kunai, a Chris, and yeah, lightsaber. But I made other things, these are just some of the weapons that I've made. Don't ask me why the table's there, I don't know why. Anyway, thanks for watching, and yeah. Also, if you don't know how to render out the image, as a, a render out the um, say you wanted to make a video of uh, actually, I think I'll go into that, but I will show you how to export the image. Go over to the render, yeah, it's render. Save this. Um, yeah, I'm gonna save as a PNG file. Select the direct, the directory, whatever it is. Uh, sorry, I'm saying that wrong. Yeah, I'm gonna save this to desktop. Accept desktop. Yeah, render image. And just go down here to the bottom left-hand corner. Image. Save as go desktop write this as monkey in dis display case dot png now save this may take a little while depending on your computer minimize that, minimize that and then boom got my picture exactly how it came up in my render well, thanks for watching, and if you want any tutorials on anything, or oh, you already said that, but yeah, still, any tutorials on anything, just leave a comment or send me a message. Thanks for watching.